which takes us to our final step called move. Um, what are we going to do about it? You know, so in the in this case for the technology global hotspot, um, we know that these two vacancies are absolutely critical to fill. So we could start saying, okay, we need to go external for these. We got to set up a search process. Um, and let's get after it. You know, so are we on track for that? Decision rights, particularly between the, the solutions group and, and commercial need to be ironed out. And if you're doing this uh, every month, let's say a, a kind of a monthly business cadence of looking at the hotspots and what are the interventions that are important? Well, in this case, they, it wasn't getting done. So this could be a flag to the CEO to say, hey, you know, we have value at risk at this hotspot these are the key interventions that we agree to. Are, are, are we progressing on those? Um, and at the end, at the end of the day, when I, when I shared the, the five bubbles, if you will, from the value agenda to this move step, we want to capture value. So we have an aspiration, we have a value bridge that you know, shows us how to get there. But at the end of the day, are we, are we capturing the value? Are we delivering the value we expected? So the next page shows that we can then bring into much more of a business review cadence how are we doing at each hotspot? Are we addressing the risks that are there? Are we capturing the value that we expected? And if you think of this kind of on a monthly reporting and kind of a quarterly reset, if you will, you know, what, what's working well? What do we need to do the next 90 days in order to continue to shore up and, and capture this value? You see the difference here. It's not just a, a, a BU PL reporting. This is like capturing the hotspots and the interdependencies between different businesses and functions in order to deliver it. 